Hey guys, today we are at KFC, but we're here not for chicken. We're here for pizza, or how they call it inside, chitza. This debuted in 2015 in the Philippines, went around the world at other locations, and after nine years, it's finally debuting today in the United States. So we're gonna take you in here and show you what this is all about. So are you ready, Bobby? I'm ready. Let's rock and roll. Let's rock and roll. Let's take a look at the different ways you can order the chitza. You can combo it for $12.99, which includes one side and a drink. Or get a regular order for $9.99, has 820 calories in it. Or if you just want one chicken breast, it's $5.99 and 410 calories. We ordered the combo. Let's take a look at the chitza. Oh yeah, look at that guys. A little grease from that pepperoni on there. You can see the mozzarella cheese. We'll go over that all here in just one second. But also back is the blackberry lemonade. Our total price on this combo with the side was $13.90. Let's go over what the chitza is. Starting off with two pieces of extra crispy 100% white meat boneless chicken breast. Kind of what's on the KFC sandwich. Zesty marinara sauce, you can see all that on there. Mozzarella cheese and savory pepperoni. See a little bit of grease in that pepperoni. That should make it pretty good. You should be able to taste that. You can look at it more when we take it out of the box. Gotta figure out how to eat this. We'll decide. Bobby's gonna try the Blackberry Lemonade that also debuted again today. We had it last mm -hmm. year. This is not out of the fountain up there. They make this in the back with Blackberry Puree. I like the purple color. It just reminds me of spring, which is right around the corner. This is very good. You get some tartness, a little bit of sweetness, and this year I can taste the Blackberry. Last year we liked this, but we didn't get a lot of the Blackberry flavor. I guess it depends on who makes it. This is very good. Maybe they changed the recipe this year. Maybe. I'm anxious to find out because I love blackberries. I'm glad they brought this back to the menu. They're just taking their lemonade and squirting that blackberry flavor in it. Now this year, I also agree you can taste the blackberry in that. And it's not as tart as just drinking lemonade. You get a lot of sweetness from it, but still has a little bit of a hint of that tartness from the lemonade. This is very good. They need to just put this in the machine up there, but probably if it was a machine, it wouldn't be as sweet because they're pouring that puree right in there. I don't know if they can get that kind of mix out of the machine. Worth getting, guys. Make sure to try this. This is a limited time also, so I don't know how long it's going to last. Let's take a look at the chitza. Bobby's going to try it. It's a nice presentation, isn't it? It is. Now, that's what I'm seeing what you're going to do. You're going after a knife and fork. Yeah, I think I'm going to try it that way. Because normally we just eat pizza, we just pick it up. I'm going to pick it right up, but let's find out how it cuts. Bobby got ready to cut this, and we noticed that it had already been cut. You will hear me talk about this later in the video. We thought both these breast patties were uncut. That surprised us. I'm going to cut it right here so I can get the pepperoni. Yeah, you got to get the pepperoni in that bite. Look, that. Look at that chicken. Looks very tender, doesn't it? They went with the extra crispy on this too. And I think they need to probably hold that marinara sauce in. Found the piece Bobby's gonna eat. Gonna have everything on that. What did you think? It reminds me of chicken barn. The marinara sauce is very good. It has a zesty flavor to it. I didn't get a lot of the mozzarella flavor, but maybe there's more over this way. But the marinara sauce is very good. You got the herbs and spices from the chicken. Got a little bit of crunch, but the chicken's very tender and moist. And I don't get a lot of flavor from the pepperoni. 
even mm. though I, you know, had a big piece. You had a whole piece. I did, but I think the marinara sauce took over that. One thing that comes to mind, because they used extra crispy chicken on this, is the marinara sauce might make this soggy if you take it mm -hmm. home. Depending on how far you live. That's probably why they did go with the extra crispy. That's usually what we get anyhow, yeah, isn't it? Yeah, it's better. All right, I'm anxious to try it. I'm gonna pick it up, because it's it's pizza. And it's it looks like it's, let's see, it's already like cut in the center. Maybe it comes in four slices, like a pizza. I don't know. I'm just gonna try it like that. This might be tough to eat in a car. I think it would make a mess. Probably drip all over you. Another look at it. It's still holding up, still crispy mm -hmm. where I have my fingers. It's not overly hot that's gonna burn your fingers, so pick it up, guys. Don't cut it with a fork and eat it, <laughs> eat it the way a pizza is supposed to be eaten. I'm going one more bite on this before I let you know what I think about it, but look, I think that has been cut. So it's in two pieces. You can get smaller pieces to pick up instead of picking up the whole chicken breast by itself. Great idea. Let's try it one more. This does taste like a chicken parm, and it's not very greasy, or it's not overly salty. You see a little bit of grease on that pepperoni, but you don't really get that from the chicken, too, because the chicken's just juicy. The KFC flavor comes through. I can't really taste the mozzarella, the marinara, and the chicken itself is what you taste. And the marinara has a slim zestiness to it. Not overly zesty, but I wish I could taste more of that pepperoni. You know what, I'm gonna do this. Let me see, now I'm gonna take another bite and see if I can get any of this pepperoni flavor. Now I am getting a little bit of tingling in the back of my throat from something zesty. Maybe that's the pepperoni. I know the marinara sauce is supposed to be a little zesty, but I didn't get that at first. Maybe that's what I'm getting from the pepperoni because when you first bite it, you don't get a lot of pepperoni flavor. It's just chicken and marinara sauce. But whatever it is, it's a good combination. I would get this again. I could probably eat both of these. I don't know, Bobby probably couldn't, but she no, could order a single one if you one. wanted to for $5.99. Mm -hmm. It's a great idea. And again, I'm stressing, even with the pepperoni and everything else that's on here, it's not overly greasy and not overly salty. And we went with fries as our sides because these are one of John's favorites. Yeah, they're good fries. If you're wanting salt from this meal, you're not gonna have a lot of salt flavor from that chitza. Order these fries, because they just have so much salt on them, different flavors. I enjoy these, plus they're crispy. We just left KFC after trying out their new chitza. Took it only nine years to reach the United States. What did you think about that and the blackberry lemonade? If you're a fan of chicken parm, I think you will like this because that's what it reminds me of. I like the zesty marinara sauce they were using, the pepperoni. They put three pieces on each piece of chicken we had, but I didn't get a lot of flavor from that or the cheese. It was like the marinara sauce just took away a lot of those flavors. The chicken was tender. It wasn't salty or greasy. We ordered the combo where you could order a side. So I think the fries was a good choice. Mm -hmm. Like John said earlier, they get that salty flavor because you didn't get any salty flavor at all, I didn't think, I didn't from think the so. chicken. I wish they would keep the blackberry lemonade on the menu all year round. That is very good. The staff here is always friendly. And they always do a great job. The chicken was crispy. That is the same chicken that they use on the sandwich, and they have a good one here. Bobby already touched on some of the things that I was going to talk about, like the pepperoni and mozzarella. You could see it on there but you couldn't taste it. You could mainly taste the marinara and those 11 herbs and spices from that chicken. They use the extra crispy. They're gonna have to do that because a regular one's not gonna hold up to the marinara sauce. It's gonna get too soggy. And I think we talked about that inside. Mm -hmm. you don't wanna eat this in your car. It's gonna make a mess. And definitely, in my opinion, you don't wanna get this as a to-go order. I think by the time you got it home, it would be really soggy. That's just my opinion the pepperoni did look pretty good on there had a little bit of grease coming out of it but i just couldn't get a lot of flavor maybe a little bit of zestiness from it there at the end in the back of your throat but overall it's still a good deal i think it's a great idea the chicken breast when they brought it to me i thought you were going to just 
eat it like this one piece but they cut that makes it easier to handle the blackberry lemonade this year was very good now we liked it last year but we thought the blackberry flavor was kind of non-existent it was really tart mm -hmm. this year it's sweet and less tart but a great blackberry flavor i think it depends on who makes it it might it's a blackberry puree and they're mixing that with dough lemonade just in case you're wondering bring that on the menu all the time that's worth getting but i don't know if you would get the same effect out of the machine because they take that big container and squirt it down in there so another good trip to kfc i was happy with this new chitza so again i'm not sure how long they're going to leave it on the menu maybe permanently if it does well but it took it nine years to get here i don't know why so long and we'd like to give a shout out to Sandy, one of our longtime subscribers. She hasn't been feeling well as late. We hope you're feeling better and we'll be thinking about you. So if you like this video, give us a thumbs up and subscribe. Yeah, so until we meet again, J&B have, have left the building. building.